dear friends today we shall discuss exercise 2.1 question number 8 which of the following statements are true and which are false a here you see a a is 0 0 is the smallest natural number now if we what are natural numbers we know that natural numbers natural numbers it starts from 1 that is 1 2 3 4 etc right therefore natural number starts from 1 2 3 4 starts from 1 therefore here the question is 0 is the smallest natural number that is wrong therefore it is false right therefore Zero is the smallest natural number. It is false because one is the smallest natural number. This is false. Now B, four hundred is the predecessor of three hundred ninety nine. Predecessor means the number you have to multiply subtract one from that. That is three ninety nine minus one. You subtract it. We are getting three hundred ninety eight. Three hundred ninety eight. Therefore, this is not true. Therefore, four hundred is the predecessor of three ninety nine is wrong. That is therefore it is false. Now C, zero is the smallest whole number. What is the definition of whole number? Whole number means whole number whole number starts from zero. That is zero one. Two, three, four. Right. Therefore, the smallest whole number is zero. The question C is zero is the smallest whole number. It is true. Therefore, we can write it as T. Therefore, this is true. D. Six hundred is the successor of five hundred ninety nine. Successor means the next one. That means the number is five ninety nine. Five hundred ninety-nine plus one. If we add plus one, then we are getting six hundred. That means it is true, right? Therefore, six hundred is the successor of successor of five hundred ninety-nine. It is true. The next one is all natural numbers are whole numbers. We already discussed that natural numbers are one, two, three, four. That is all natural numbers are whole numbers. Yes, right? Because here you see the whole number starts from Whole number starts from zero, right? That means zero, and natural number includes the whole number. Therefore, all natural numbers are whole numbers. That is true, right? That is is true. It is true. Now, question number F. All whole numbers are natural numbers. All whole numbers are natural numbers. No. Because in whole numbers zero is including, and in natural numbers it starts from one, two, three, four, right? Therefore, all whole numbers are natural numbers is false, right? That means it is false. It is not true. Therefore, it is false. Next one is G. The predecessor of a two-digit number is never a single-digit number. Suppose we are taking two-digit number that is ten. Suppose we are taking two-digit number that is ten, and the predecessor of ten is nine. It is a single-digit number, right? The here, G is the predecessor of a two-digit number is never a single-digit number is false, right? Therefore, we can say it as false. This is false. Now, question number H. One is the smallest whole number. That is false. Why? Because the whole number starts from zero. That is zero, one, two, three, four. One is the smallest whole number. It is false. Right? Therefore, it is false. The natural number one has no predecessor. The natural number one has no predecessor. I already told you that natural number starts from one. 
point two natural number it starts from one that is one two three four like this right that means the natural number has the channel number one has no predecessor is true right therefore this number is true the natural number one has no predecessor is true the whole number one has no predecessor the whole number one has no predecessor you so you see the whole number starts from zero therefore the predecessor of one is zero the predecessor one is zero right therefore the whole number one has no predecessor is false it is false next one is the whole number 13 lies between 11 and 12 the whole number 13 lies between 11 and 12 this is also false right between but this is false the whole number 0 has no predecessor the whole number 0 has no predecessor it is right because whole number starts from 0 you see here the whole number whole number starts from 0 that means the whole number 0 has no predecessor it is true the successor of a two digit number is always a two digit number suppose you are taking two digit number that is 99 therefore the successor of 99 is 100 it is a three digit number right here it says the successor of a two digit number is always a two digit number that is false right therefore this is the false right this is the solution of question number eight dear friends if you like this video please subscribe like and share thank you everybody for watching this video